previously on Welcome to the Family. She happened to be wearing a quarter on her forehead. Okay, does not mean screaming. People that say often and real a tour. He ended up crashing his car. We were like, oh my gosh, what happened? Oh, I know what that was. <laughs> oh, shit. Anyone can entertain you, but only we entertain you. With a mixture of fun, learning, and craziness, my team and I travel the world motivating and connecting with people. Are you ready? Welcome to the family. Alex, come here. Valerie, come here. You want to try this? His name is Kali, Kali Muscle. I think he's, he's a bodybuilder. He calls this mud. Now, it's not Coke and it's not this coffee. It's actually instant coffee and Coke or anything that fizzles. And then when you put it together, you're supposed to open up your vascular and it gives you all this energy and, you know, close to a heart attack type of thing. So you're going to drink mud? We're going to drink some mud. Okay, we're going to open up the coffee. Now, we're going to open the... Can it get cold or just like that? Or? Just like this. It looks like espresso. <laughs> it does. Better than any energy drink, supposedly. Well, Coke and caffeine. Mm -hmm. Double caffeine. And you can drink this? I'm drinking mud. Oh my god. <laughs> you gotta be strong. Yes, you do. Mm -mm. <laughs> ah, here we go. Yeah, I feel a heart attack coming on. I wanna try it. Oh. <laughs> I'm ready to run a marathon. Mmm. You gotta chug it. Oh my god. <laughs> yes, you must chug. I'm not drinking, man. You're not gonna hurl from it. It just tastes bad. I know, but I have past experience of chugging too much and throwing up. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, Thank you for oh, telling me while I'm standing right in front of you oh, while you're chugging. Oh, <laughs> Ugh. It actually works. I'm awake. That's dangerously oh. delicious. Mud. You know what I it stands like for? Mm. Makes you dangerous. <laughs> <laughs> this is yours. Oh, Let me grab a cup of. No, drink your cup. Oh, mud. Yeah. He's about to drink some mud. There you go, chug. You gotta chug it. Mm. Makes you dangerous. No way. <laughs> okay. Who's that, Miles? I don't know. You just drank some mud. You got mud lips. This could replace CO2? Yeah, so why spend the money when you what? got mud? No sh So he needs to package this, dude. So am I gonna be hyped up after this? You're supposed to. So Valerie and I wanted to get some information for a nonprofit organization that we're building and uh, we went to this workshop in Miami Beach. Got her to Parallel Park over here, and then we proceeded to pay at the machine, but the machine didn't print out, even though we paid, did not print out, print out the receipt, and some person walked past us and told us, if you don't display it in your dash, even though you paid, you'll get a ticket. So now they've proceeded to go across the street to go to another machine to see if they can do it. These are the wonderful things you get to experience when you come to Miami Beach. That was quite a little episode of of her trying to figure it out. Yay! <laughs> We're looking at one of the cars over there already has a ticket, so apparently they're quick. So then we went inside to our workshop. So here at Bo Studios, we have a lot of crazy ideas, like all the time. And for one of our recent projects, we needed a specific talent. Oh, I get to hear your mom's voice. Calling my mother. I needed my mom's help because it was my sister that kind of fit the perfect criteria that we needed. I'm gonna text her to call me. Hello. So your mom's ignoring you. Pretty much. <laughs> hey mom. Hey honey, how are you? Pretty good, pretty good. Are you busy? Um, always, but what's going on? Cool. <laughs> Quick question. I need your help yes. with, um, you know the, the videos I showed you last night for the whole um, tour and documentary thing? This is a movement in human consciousness. In order to make this documentary, we need your support. Right, mm -hmm. We have um, a commercial idea that we're about to do, but we need talent of a specific sort. Uh, for this kind of uh, little commercial that we're doing, we need a little cute, beautiful girl. 
Can we borrow Sarah as talent to put in this commercial? Hmm, let me see. A cute little girl. Let me see. Jesus Christ. Uh, <laughs> Yeah, that's fine. Cool. All right, it's um. When, when, now, when is it for? Uh, as yeah. soon as possible. All righty. Okay. All righty. Then let me um. When we pick her up tonight, do you want me to to drop her off? Do you want me to call you? What yeah, you that'd do? be cool. Yeah, call me and drop her off. I'm, I'm gonna be here all day. Okay. All right. Then we'll give you a buzz tonight. All right. All right, mama. Thank no, you. Okay, no problem. I'll call you today. All right, cool. Okay. Love you. All right, All right. It was only after the phone call that I kind of realized that I should have maybe told my mom the premise of the commercial. You didn't tell your mom the premise? Yeah, no. <laughs> we needed a little girl crying, so... <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> that is so messed up. I, I don't know. Maybe I should have told her. Alright, so right now I'm out here with Julian. Uh, right now we're hitting up some uh, rock climbing gym. So my mother had came to me and given me these vouchers for a rock climbing gym. So you walk in and it's like those rock climbing walls you see at the fair, but it's just like a lot of them and they're all connected. So they give you a 30 minute course on how to like belay, which is how to use the rope and how to like catch somebody and repel them down and the whole course on just how to generally rock climb. Alright, so I hold it like this. Pull it up. No, you never let go of this hand, all right? This is the hand that you let go. So it's gonna be like this. You're gonna, once you pull. And then after that, they just let you uh, go for it. Little warm-ups on the top. This pothole kind of uh, magically appeared. I did not see it before I hit it, and uh, it's okay. Y you can laugh. Uh, I, I was crying, laughing, kind of like a mix. <laughs> it, it was happening fast, and then right when I kind of hit that, I was like, ah, oh. <laughs> something's gonna break. Something is going to break. I figured out my phone broke and I tried turning it on. It's just like this black dot with a white screen. Yeah, dude, I hit that pothole hard. I lost the music. <laughs> Today's motorcycle tip slash lesson is um, watch out for potholes. They're everywhere. You start following like these little pieces of tape that are colored, depending on what color you actually end up climbing, is determining the level of difficulty of your climb. Look, look up, look at your right hand, you see that red one up there? Try to go for that one, yeah. Push up and go for that one. It was a blast, it's actually a really good workout. Like, I walk out of there and you actually, your forearms hurt a lot and your legs, cause you actually gotta learn how to use your legs in order to climb. You gotta jump and pull. Yeah, like you have to pull down and jump and like lock it. There you go, you feel it? My friend Julian has like no body weight so he can like toss himself. Yo, it's a baby! <laughs> it's a baby! So he was climbing up the wall faster than I can belay him. So 
when you finally got to the top and jumped. Woo! I'm going down. There was like maybe like a foot gap loose and you kind of like felt like a little free fall for a second. It scared the hell out of him. For me, I was just laughing because I saw it coming since he was climbing so fast. I almost fell a couple times. That was intense. This is Alexa from Welcome to the Family. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Hey. Oh yeah, and share with your friends and family.